organizational structures will be disrupted, changed depending on the ability of organizations to embrace social technologies in the way they work. Typically, any computing or technology, when it has been embraced into organizations, has changed organizations as much as organizations have changed that technology. So what we have seen earlier in the ERP era or when first technology was uh, uh, used like email, it changed business processes. It, business processes need to be worked out for information to flow smoothly. But corporate social networking will actually change the way people have relationships with other people within organizations. So if ERP was an area where we tracked information processes, so corporate social networks will be the ERP for business relationships and relationships between employees with each other and between employees and other customers, prospective customers within organizations and outside organizations. So what we will see is that business uh, structures might remain, but they will be, the silo functions will not be, exist. People will see a lot more of uh, fluidity in way teams can be set up, teams can be worked on. We'll see a lot more collaborative social groups forming around a specific initiative, people enrolling out of it due to their own uh, needs their own uh, interests and building skills that would take them in their say a social career path and we have already examples of organizations uh, that are enabling tools like that to happen uh, and we will see a lot more of that uh, happening in the near future the other big change structurally is that between organizations and external sh stakeholders. External stakeholders could be um, the external community where the organization exists, um, could be analysts, could be customers, could be vendors, suppliers, other partners. What we will see is that that iron curtain that exists or the firewall that exists in today's uh, time and age will go a lot down. Organizations will realize that when customers are talking back to them, prospective customers are um, seeking information on their products, there cannot be just a one window for them to communicate. And organizations will understand that the way to manage this whole flood of information coming via social networks, via Facebook, Twitter, external communities to them, is by letting their employees engage with these customers, these stakeholders, these partners, and helping them forge relationships and really, uh, I think Zappos CEO, uh, uh, Tony Shave said it brilliantly when he said, the culture will be the brand of the organization. Organizations have started to realize it, and the more open, transparent culture they build, the more uh, of a better brand they will build, both within and externally, of organizations and that I think is the way organizations have to think about corporate social networking not just a place for employees to socialize with each other but as a step towards engaging with external stakeholders and shaping the brand of the organization and product that and services that it offers I think that is where the next generation of organization is going to get forward to